everybody welcome back to my channel so today's video you can tell by the title is my tanning routine and um, i'm so excited to say that i'm working with so Sue by sj and dripping gold tan in this video it's honestly my favorite tan in the whole world like i am obsessed with it and um, i love all the products and i have a few products here to try out that i haven't tried before you can use my code LDUCK15 for 15% off the website. It doesn't work on sale items, bundles and the Bahama body tan, but it works on everything else. And it genuinely is the best tan. Like it just, there's nothing. I would even compare this tan to it. What just happened? <laughs> so Sue is my absolute favorite tan. I am obsessed with all the makeup products as well. I'm thinking of doing a video of the So Sue by SJ. Um, makeup products as well but today it's just the tanning products so I'm gonna take you through what I do what my favorite products are and um, some new products and yeah I don't know what the best way to do it is without like getting my video taken down for nudity so that's fantastic so I'm gonna do my best to show you how I do my tan and stuff so I really hope you enjoy I'm firstly thinking I'm gonna take you through the products and then show you what I do so I just thought I'd show you this is like my natural color I still have a tiny bit of tan residue but I am, like, I'm quite pale. Well, I'm very pale. Like, if I go on holidays, I get a spray tan before I go because I don't, like, I don't take a colour at all. I just go red and it doesn't turn into tan. So, that's my natural colour. Um, Yeah, like, I am, I'm very pale. So, I rely on pink tan a lot. But you know what? I've actually been, like, not wearing tan as much lately. And I'm trying to, like, like myself without tan. And I actually don't hate myself without tan. So... So now that you've seen me in my natural state, um, I'm going to take you through the products in the order of how I would use them. A few of these products I tried last night for the first time so I can kind of give you an impression now, but I will be using them again. So I'll give you more of a review the more I use it. So the first product that I picked up yesterday and that I tried last night is the Drip and Gold Luxury Tanning Pre-Party Polish. I absolutely love this. Like I had like not a thick layer of tan left yesterday but I had like definitely like on my hands and stuff which I find hard to get off because I worked in a hairdresser for three years and developed quite a bad dermatitis on my hands from shampooing so much and having a lot of chemicals on my hand from colour shampoo etc so I find tan quite hard to get off my hands just because I do have like dermatitis on my hands this literally got it off straight away like my hands are completely pale um, it was so nice, it smells so nice. It's not a harsh exfoliator. I didn't feel it was harsh on my skin at all. Really, 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 really liked it, genuinely. I thought it was so good. It smells like, I don't even know, I can't describe the smell, but it's really nice, it's quite fresh. Um, just says vol vol volcanic, <laughs> sand particles, skin smoothing salicylic acid, and enriched with vitamin E. So I really, really, really enjoyed it, and I'm gonna be trying it again today, just to exfoliate the last bit, because I probably do have a little bit of residue left on my chest. So I'm going to try that again today. God, I can't breathe. Whew. Anyway, so the second product that I tried last night, and again, I will be trying today again, is the Dripping Gold Luxury Tanning Post Party Nourishing Body Moisturizer. I cannot describe the smell of this. It's coconut, but I don't usually like coconut. But this is just, it's not too strong. It's not overpowering. I thought it was so nice and... Um, Organic coconut extracts, moisture lock, and tan prolonging. So I'll try this again with the tan on. I'll let you know probably on Instagram how I get on with that. Um, but absolutely love it. It's quite, I found it heavy, but in a nice way. I felt like it took a while to soak into the skin, which was nice at night time. Um, because I felt really moisturized going to bed, if that makes sense. Does that make sense? I think it does. Absolutely loved it, loved the smell. My skin, like the smell of it lingers, like my body still smells like coconut which I personally really like um, and I definitely feel, you can probably see I keep feeling my neck, I'm actually so weird, but I feel really moisturised and the only other moisturiser, body moisturiser wise, that does that for me is the one from the body shop and I really, really like this and I think it'll be really good at prolonging my tan. So I'll let you know again how I get on with that when I do use it for my tan, probably on Instagram as well. So really, really, really like this and I can't wait to try it again. As for the main event, um, this is a tan I'm gonna be trying, I really popped up there. Jesus, anyway, this is the tan that I'm gonna be trying. So I've always used the mousses, absolutely love the mousses, but got this as a present. So it is the Dripping Gold Luxury Tanning Liquid Luxe Satin Smooth Liquid Tan Ultra Dark. Oh, um, so this is just, it's not obviously a mousse, it's a liquid tan. Um, it comes in this bottle. 
it is a spray. So I think I spray it onto the mitt. Um, so I'm really excited to try this. What else does it say? Um, enriched with vitamin A, vitamin E, hyaluronic acid and natural extracts of goji berry and chamomile. So with the hyaluronic acid, I'm guessing it's going to be really moisturizing, which is good. Um, so I'm really, really excited to try this. So I'll let you know how application, everything goes with that. Um, and then these two products are my most used, I keep popping up, my most used and my most loved products. So this I probably won't be using in the video, but I just wanted to talk about it anyway. This is the Body Tune Instant Tan Ultra Dark. Um, I use this on nights out, well, I could go on nights out, on my legs and stuff on top of tan, and it just adds such a glow, a bit of colour. Absolutely love it. I think it's amazing. It's one of my favourite products from um, Dripping Gold. I just think it's deadly. Like, I have nothing bad to say about this tan. This, it's an instant tan, obviously, illuminating finish. Um, it's a wash off. It's just amazing. Like, amazing. <laughs> That's all I have to say about that. So, in terms of face tan, I don't like putting mousses on my face and stuff just because I'm afraid. I just like using something that's made for the face. So this is obviously made for the face. Um, and I use it on my hands and my feet as well. So this is a Dripping Gold Luxury Tanning Wonder Water. This is the medium to dark. It's obviously very well loved. Um, but I put this on my face with a Kabuki brush. It gives me a gorgeous even tan. 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 <laughs> like what? Then I use it on my feet and I use it on my hands. So I absolutely love it. So I'm going to try out these products. Let you know how it goes. Forgot to tell us. I'm filming this on a tripod. Don't mind me being a YouTuber. I literally ordered this tripod on Amazon for like 25 euro and it's actually daddy, look, I can pick you up and off. It's actually so good because usually I'd only be able to film. Like, I used, you probably see here, if you watch my vlogs and stuff, I used to just put the phone there and that was the only place I could film because like, it was the only place I could stand the phone up in good lighting, but now I can just carry it wherever I want like it's actually class it was 25 euro Amazon delivery took three days and um customs was only four euro so class it was class like it was so handy so I feel like I'm a proper youtuber now yeah now all I need is subscribers <laughs> okay so trying to do this PG has proven to be quite a challenge so we're gonna try our best so I've showered and exfoliated it says to not moisturize prior to tanning so I haven't put any moisturizer on but I do absolutely love the moisturizer and I will be um sharing the tan off probably in the morning and I'll let you know how the moisturizer goes then because I'm obviously going to put it on after my shower to prolong my tan so I'm going to go in with the liquid looks now and let you know that's one layer um I really think it's going on so nicely it's gone on so easily it's blending gorgeous so I'm going to go in for a second layer but I have put on um two layers of the liquid looks it honestly went on, sorry, I have to get my mouth in my back, but um, it went on absolutely gorgeously. It blended like an absolute dream. I actually found it much easier to blend than the mousse. Um, usually I would do two layers. I do like quite a dark tan. So hopefully, sorry, I keep seeing the pale part, but my mom was on my back. Um, yeah, it went on like an absolute dream. No complaints so far. Absolutely loved it. Ooh, I've applied the tan all over me and like I said when I did my legs and stuff it just went on gorgeously like I've absolutely no complaints so far other than I think the spray bottle takes a little bit longer to get used to I found it was kind of spraying all over my room but I think that's just because I need to get used to it so now I'm gonna go in with the dripping gold wonder water if you put this on your face make sure you put like vaseline or something in your eyebrows because I used to not and I dyed my eyebrows ginger by accident like with tan and I went to get my brows done. The first time I got my brows done off my brow girl, she was like, you have ginger brows. I was like, no, I don't. I did, because of tan. In my eyebrows, they stayed in my eyebrows. Now my eyebrows aren't um, ginger, but they used to be. So make sure. So I'm gonna spray this directly onto the brush. The only thing from So Sue I feel like I don't have is the Kabuki brush. So I'm gonna be really cheeky and use my own discount code um, for a Kabuki brush. This does fine, but I want like the whole bank so i'm just putting this on my face and um, it takes like about an hour until i personally see like a difference but even now like i, d I don't know if it's like what's that called um placebo effect maybe it's placebo effect that like make sure you do your ears it annoys me when people don't do their ears um that like i feel like i'm seeing color already but like i'm not um so yeah put that all over my face and i'm gonna do my hands and my feet i feel a bit bronzed I'm um, actually I don't know if any of you know Alex Hesden she's a YouTube channel as well 
she's amazing i'm obsessed with her videos but she actually she actually puts tan on um she used the liquid looks as well on her chest with a brush so maybe i'll try that as well so yeah, I'm gonna leave this to develop and I will be back. So it's a lot later in the day and I don't even think the lighting is doing this justice, but I just wanted to show you the tan. So this is two layers. It's developed absolutely gorgeous. I didn't put enough on my hands, so I'm gonna fix them later. Um, but it's definitely my new favorite tan, the nicest application I've had in a long time. And it's actually, I think, taken the place of the mousse, which is a big thing to say because I love the mousse. Even though I'm not going anywhere, I wanted to show you this. This is the body tune I was talking about earlier and I wasn't gonna put it on. But I said I just put on a bit to like show you the difference and I really hope this line does it justice. Um, so I would use this like I said if I was going out and stuff. So I'm just going to put it on my chest just a little bit. Look at it, it's like not metallic, I don't really know the word. But it's like, it has a bit of a shine to it. Sorry, I just moved in here because I wanted to show you with embedded lighting. Even though the lighting's crap and it's not giving the full effect that I want to give. It doesn't match my face like I said because I just put this on to show you. The difference but like look at the difference when you put that on like for a night out and the glow i also have this dripping gold endless summer and um, i have it in the shimmer and i just wanted to show you that um on as well so obviously it looks like that it's quite had it for ages look at that glow like i know it looks probably a bit ridiculous now i look very dark but can you imagine on the first night out i'm gonna cake myself in this on the first night out Stunning. Okay, this is really annoying me, but you you know like you don't know what I mean. Like when I say it literally isn't, was not gonna match my face, so honestly stunning. Like it looks ten times better in person. I hope you can get like I hope you get the gist because like when I'm looking in the mirror here, it looks so much better. I'll try to show you it in the mirror and see does that look better. Okay, I hope this is a little bit better. But I hope you can see like the glow that these tans together give is just absolutely gorgeous. I'm obsessed. Liquid Lux has won my heart. Oh, love it so much. If I see one comment telling me that my tan doesn't match my face, I'm going to scream. Because I've said it 10,000 times that I know it doesn't match. So let's just leave, leave that there and let's not talk about that. Because look at the glow. Just think about the glow. Come on. Look at that. Ooh. So I'm going to end this video here. I hope you got some good tips and tricks. And remember, you can use my code LDUCK15 on the website for 15% off. I'm so sorry that the lighting was crap at the end of this, but I just really wanted to show you it when it was developed. So I will see you very soon. And thank you so much for watching. I love you.